Hello and welcome to this week's Trading the Trend on Wednesday, the 5th of April 2023. At the beginning of March, we went short the Australian dollar versus the New Zealand dollar and uh, we lowered our stop loss last week to 107.86. It got hit, but only intraday. We didn't close above it. And as we uh, all know by now, I guess that uh, the Trading the Trend stop losses are always on a daily closing basis. So we didn't get stopped on this one and the trade is still very much intact. And we are currently heading down towards our downside target at 105.50 on this trade. Another profitable trade we also still have on is the British pound uh, long against the Japanese yen. Here we also intraday got um, near our stop loss level and hit that, but not on a daily chart closing basis. So that one's still very much valid. We went long at 162 yen and 50 sen. And I would li like, like to raise our take profit level on an intraday closing basis, though, to break even. That means that if 162.50 were to get hit, then we get out of this trade with no loss. But we're still leaving the uh, possibility for the market to continue to uh, hike, to, 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 to advance further in the days and weeks to come. But I'm, I'm just wanting to, to move my stop up simply because of this shooting star formation and uh, because I might, I'm worried that with uh, Easter we might uh, have a reversal, a short term at least in low liquidity, lower uh, taking us um, out of this trade. Now, another long trade we had on was to go long the NASDAQ 100. We went long at 12,100, uh, then got out around here and then went long again a couple of weeks ago at 12,730. And here, because we see a little volatility at the moment, uh, heading into Easter, I'd also be more comfortable to take some money off the table. And if we do so now, we would have a, a profit in place of about 340 points, which is always nice. So that's another one I'd like to get out of. And um, now I would like to quickly show you uh, today's trading the trend. And that is to go short the Australian dollar versus the um, US dollar. And as you can see here, we seem to continue the previous downtrend and are heading towards this uptrend line here. And uh, I expect this to be taken out together with the March lows at 65.65 and for the currency pair to drop all the way back down to, to 63 or so. So uh, today's trading the trend is to go short the Australian dollar versus the US dollar at current levels around 66.90 with a downside target at 63 and a stop loss at 67.95.